Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm back with another hair installation video and today I'm featuring in colour wigs. In colour wig. So they sent me this ginger curly hair that I've been so excited to try and I finally got the time to try it and install it. Um, yeah, so the hair came in this cute box with a bag that has your wig cap eyelashes and a comb and it also has a gift of earrings so yeah that's what i'm going to be this is the hair i'm going to be installing today i didn't bleach the knots this is how the knots came all i did was put foundation onto the lace you can tint your lace um yeah and i plucked the lace very quickly very easy to pluck this hair plucked beautifully Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to cut the hair into one and two. So I've cut the hair into three. Then I'm going to cut out my ear tabs. I don't install any elastic band. This is just a natural wig. So I'm just going to tug at it a little bit so that it's easier to cut too. And it stops here because that's where the wig construction starts so I can't really cut too much like that. I'm just going to do the same thing on the other side. I just literally get as close to the roots of the hair as possible and I want to cut in a zigzag motion across. A lot of people use eyebrow razors but personally I just feel like I have more control with um, scissors because it's not me that's going to go and cut my whole frontal in half because I feel like I will be that person to try the eyebrow razors and then just shh, easily just get all the way back. This is the lace cut. Um, the natural hairline of the wig is kind of squarey, so I'm thinking whether I should cut it back. I did kind of like pluck it back anyway, but I don't want to go too back. Where is the? Because the pine space isn't the biggest anyway, so yeah. Just gonna cut the other side now. I can't lie, this wig has surprised me. It has, I am pleasantly surprised by this wig. So far, so great. <laughs> so far, so great, honestly.
now i'm just going to take a couple strands pull a couple strands out and this is going to be what's going to be the baby here skin this hair is ginger basically brown and it kind of blends into my skin so i have to take more than usual so that it will actually show And then I'm going to take my elastic band to just secure that lace down. Okay, so now my, my lace has been marinating for God knows how long. I'm going to start cutting the edges and stuff. Okay, so to lay the edges down, I'm just going to use the Afro G hair mousse. This is just going to make sure that the hair stays in place. Then I'm going to go in with my elastic band again to melt that lace further into my skin. then i'm just showing you guys the hair like this hair the color is just so beautiful i feel like it complements my skin very well um it's very different for me i'm used to like blondes and browns so gingers it's not too far off but it is quite different so i don't know how i was feeling about the wig um in terms of the hair color i love it like i feel like it's 10 out of 10 the um lace is also very very good i'll give it like a seven and then in terms of the curl pattern, I would say it's probably like a six. It could be better, um, but it's not bad for coloured hair. Do you know what I mean? Coloured hair is usually not the strongest, not the greatest. But they 
actually tries really well and i would give them that so in terms of the colored hair i would say this overall is a good wig like i have nothing extremely bad to say about this hair You can also see how the colour kind of like tones down when you wet the hair. It goes to like a ashy brown type colour. But then when it's dry, it's proper ginger. So I am excited to work with them again with a coloured wig. I don't know what colour to do next. But <laughs> yeah, I'm really pleased, pleasantly surprised with this wig. If you are too and you're interested in purchasing this, purchasing this wig, all the details will be in the description box down below. If you enjoy the video, make sure you like, comment and subscribe and I will see you guys in my next one. Stay blessed, stay safe and stay prayed up.